Among the golden hills of the Marimma that turn towards the sea resides the village of Pianzano, which quietly illuminated by the autumn sun, extends itself. Perhaps known as Plautiano or Planzano, we cannot say with certainty where its name has derived from, and many doubt its origins. In any case, we know for a fact that these lands had been inhabited since the Etruscan period. Ancient archaeological traces can still be found scattered all along the roads leading to the nearby towns of Capodimonte, Tuscania, Cellere and Valentano. What is certain is that there was the presence of a first permanent Enneolithic settlement here, which has been confirmed by the discovery of a large collection of flint arrowheads which are now preserved in the Luigi Pigorini National Museum of Prehistory and Ethnography in Rome. In some of the tombs found in the area, dating from the 4th and 3rd centuries BC, objects and sarcophagi were discovered. One of them has been conserved in the atrium of Pianzano's town hall and bears the inscription of its owner's name, while another is housed in the Gentili Palace in Viterbo, which houses a terracotta polychrome sarcophagus lid dating back to the late Etruscan age.